my cat is screaming on the background, sorry. Um, okay, I'll, I'll just start. Okay, so you clicked on this video and maybe you get a little bit scared with idle or <laughs> disappointed, I don't know. Please hear me out and make sure that you watch video till the end so we can discuss some things in the comments. Okay? Okay, good, so let's just start. I'm pretty sure that there is a lot of newcomers and junior artists among us. <laughs> to be honest, I think that I'm a junior as well. So when people start thinking about starting their art journey, some of them go and watch tutorials on YouTube, Pinterest or somewhere else. But there is also a big percent of people who start to draw someone's art or redraw enemy characters. And this is not so bad and I'm not trying to say, oh my gosh, you're just not allowed to redraw anything. No, deny it. Get out of there and start already draw good original cool art, you little piece of crap. <laughs> no. Everyone has gone through this, so I don't really judge people who draw, but there is some things that are just wrong and we will talk about it in another video. But now I want to say that both of these types of young artists who are just beginning, after they draw something, they start thinking like, huh, okay, this is not so bad, I think, or okay, this looks horrible, I'll just burn it. And then they look at other professionals' artists drawing and start to compare themselves with them and think about their own mistakes in proportions, perspective, coloring, etc. Like they've done a mortal thing. And here's our first mistake. Excessive or inequivalence comparing. I'll explain. When I say excessive or inequivalence, I mean that people who just started to draw or have been already drawing for a while start to compare themselves with artists that have been working on their arts and techniques for years. And I mean not one or two or even three years, I mean five, eight and more. Some of them have been doing this for about from 10 to 15 years to get the point where they are now. And this is Absolutely okay, because when we start to do something, we instinctively want to do this as good as seasoned professionals do. And of course, this is good to strive for ideal, but we should always remember that sometimes it takes time to become as good as some artists you like up to. And here's our next problem coming out. Rush. Okay, let's be honest. Everyone wants to become pro really quickly and faster than your opponents or people your age. And then stands to reason. Because even our school system says that you should get the best mark in your class and learn everything the teacher says or you will end up on the street being homeless. Oh, and you end up to go to university just after school because you don't have any time. And you should get the normal job. And because of this and other issues, we want to do everything quickly. Because the line is coming for you. So then, lots of beginner artists who have the potential, but lack skills need a little bit more time. Because they can just look at their drawing and think something like, maybe this is just not for me. Who even needs me? There's a lot of wonderful artists that are already good. Who needs my shitty artwork? And here comes our next really important point. You give up too soon. Sure, some artists learn faster than others, but you have to keep in mind that everyone has their own path of learning and everyone has their own path. Maybe you should take a little bit more time to learn. Don't worry, it's completely normal. You may say, I'm already 19 years old and I still can draw. It doesn't matter how old are you. If you really want to do what you love, you should take a breath and just be patient. Yes, it will take some time, but you will be better and better with every step you take. I think that this is no final point in art because the sky's the limit. And you will grow up your skills anyway. But if it's thing that you really love, just go for it. And as one classic said, the best job is a well-paid hobby, because if it will make you happy, it is the most important thing. I wish you a lot of good luck, my bunnies, and I believe in you with all of my heart. Stay healthy and happy. See you later.
get out of there instead of already draw good, cool, cool, original art. 